the race for Chicago mayor, it shows that this contest is in essence tied. It's the second poll confirming just how close it is between Paul Vallis and Brandon Johnson. And this poll shows the contest is deeply divided along racial lines. Our political reporter Marianne Ahern is here with the latest on the numbers. Marianne. Alex and Marianne, good afternoon. With Johnson and Vallis essentially tied, the fight is over the 10 percent still undecided. These women, who are a part of the Cook County Democratic Women Organization, support Paul Vallis. Former Cook County Clerk David Orr is endorsing Brandon Johnson. Ricky Jones gets right to the question today. Is this contest all about race? They're trying to make it into a black and white issue, but it's not about black and white. And the more people see and hear from Paul, the more they understand that. A new mayor's poll conducted this week shows Vallis 46%. Johnson, 44 percent, 10 percent undecided. With the margin of error, they're essentially tied. We know how we're doing. Uh, we know whether or not our, our message is resonating. And we're very positive that we're headed for victory on April 4th. But clearly, we still have a lot of work to do. We still have to stay on message. While this survey shows Vallis leads with white voters, Johnson leads with black voters, the two groups still most up in the air voters along the North Lakefront and Hispanic voters. Stephen Maynard Caliando is a political science professor at North Central College. This race is really demonstrating that Chicagoans are divided and, and the latest poll reflecting how close this race is shows that we have different ideas about how to move forward. With public safety the issue, Johnson and Vallis offer far different visions. For both candidates, crime is a central feature. It's just, uh, are we going to use more traditional ways uh, to solve crime? Or are we going to be more, have more creative ways that may be more um, a risk, that may be more risky because they haven't been tried on a in a widespread way. So what should we be looking for? Candidates do like to end on a positive note, usually. But in a tight race like this, don't look for those negative ads to go away either. They're going to continue to show comparisons between their points of view. we got a ways to go. Two more weeks. We'll see. If Not we even. Tight. Right. That's true. That's right. Less than two weeks. You're right. All right. Thanks, Marianne. Mm -hmm. And early voting is open right now in all 50 wards. You can find out where to vote on our website, NBCChicago.com. Just click on Chicago mayoral election. That'll be at the trending bar right at the top of the screen.